What are you doing right now, love? Getting ready for our trip, kid. I can't. <laughs> I am packing for our exciting weekend that we have planned. Well, not really weekend. I would say it's an extended weekend, you know. Really? <laughs> I just want to be there. I want to see everything. My clothes are right there. Papa, you can't go on the bed right now, Mom, honey. Okay. <laughs> Today is the day. Today is the day. Good morning, love. We're going to Universal today. <laughs> so I'm super excited. It's literally like two and a half hours before we leave to get on the plane. Our flight takes off at 345. We should land about 6.30. We plan on going right to Cabana Bay. That's where we're staying, checking in, and then we're going to shoot right over to Halloween Horror Nights because we have our frequent fear passes. So that means that we're going to be able to go Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday when we're there, which is awesome. Let me show you just what I'm packing for like a four to five day trip. Because we're only staying the four nights, we're just gonna bring our backpacks. Right now, I just have an outfit for each day, as well as what I'm wearing to fly down. Pink tops, pajamas, socks, bathing suit, and then obviously, like, if you saw our one video, I'm very big <laughs> on, like, Tums and Advil toiletries. This is, like, Clorox wipe tissues, because I didn't have my little pack of tissues I like to bring, masks if we need it. And then, of course, our favorite bag to use, you can tell that it's been through it. Oh, can't forget the headphones. I'm also going to bring my flip flops to go by the pool and my sneakers for the park. The goal is to get four days worth of stuff into a backpack. Ba -ba. We have to get rid of at the airport, Mike is working. That's okay. just got out and we are going to get the lift to Cabana Bay. A little longer than a few minutes later. We're here!
we are in the leaky cauldron. We landed, just dropped our stuff off because we were just so excited to come here. We were walking around the park, decided to take a stroll through Diagon Alley and saw that this place was pretty much empty. And if you guys been here before and you come during the day, sometimes it's a long time just to get in here. So we figured, get some fish and chips, grab a spot, enjoy the ambiance, and then get scared. Very excited. They did this on purpose, the leaky cauldron. The next day. We are going to the passholder lounge to get our magnets and pins. Do you know what they are actually? I didn't get a I chance to jazz. see this. Oh, it is jazz. That's gonna be cool for uh, for Halloween. Oh, it looks like there's a line and a half. Check out this line, guys. Just to get in. Wow. So surprised. <laughs> So we've just conquered ET. Absolutely love that ride. Just telling Steph before, if they were to ever decide to take ET out, I'm starting like <laughs> a riot. A riot, <laughs> petitions all over. I'm gonna call Stevie Spielberg, get him on the phone, get him down here because I'm gonna be absolutely devastated. Tell them what you got us for the house. Oh, I got incense to burn that smelled like the ET ride. It's like a tease because every time she lights it. I'm like, <laughs> and we, just when we take came me back. Here, we wanted to test it to see if it really smells like it, and it does. I ordered it for, off Etsy from someone who actually lives here, so it's really cool to yeah. have that. It's a nice comparison between the two. I love it. You gotta make sure you get more from her. Oh yeah, for sure. I want to get a candle, and I think they have like an oil. It's the time that we've been waiting for. It's the start of HHN. The rain cleared up a little bit, which was nice. They got the music changed over. We're waiting for the controller minions to come out. I guess that's what you would call them. They're kind of like minions, but they're the scare actors. As it gets a little darker, we're gonna show you what's going on throughout the park so you can get an idea of what happens here and you can see if you wanna come or not. I, this is our first time coming to HHN. And I'm impressed. The houses are insane. I'm not a big horror person. I Steph am. loves the horror movies. I've been going first. So yeah, I have to walk behind her. You know, you call me what you want, but I'm still making it through. We can't show any of the houses, unfortunately. Cheers. First house of the night, HHN Icons. How are you feeling about this house, Steph? Oh, I'm excited. Wow, what's happening? I'm excited, we haven't gone on this one yet, and it's only 25 minutes, so we'll see if it will be 25 minutes. So we just finished HHN Icons. It was at a 25 minute wait. From the time we got onto the line into the house, it was only 10 minutes. Now, 45. <laughs> After doing Icons, we decided to try one of the drink stands that they have set up. Steph and I ended up going with the Voodoo yeah, Ranger yeah. IPA. It's really good. Absolutely delicious. I recommend you try it. You can either do a souvenir cup or get the draft. So. Souvenir cup was $13.50? 13 or 14 But then if you refill it, it's $10. Ask the guy, is the souvenir cup larger than the regular beer? Because these are $10. So if they're trying to say, oh, you get the refill for $10, well, regular beer is $10 too. So just keep that yeah. in mind. If you want the souvenir cup to have the souvenir cup, then get it. You don't actually get more. He did say was that like the hard alcohol, like for example, the Ghoul's Punch is given to you in a smaller cup. So if you do get the HHN souvenir cup, then you'll get a bigger serving if you get hard alcohol. Oh, that's good to But know. not beer. Yeah. Cool. So we're going to let you guys know if we do another food stand or not, or drink stand, I should say. Uh, I guess I'm getting hungry because I mentioned food, so... <laughs> The twisted taters are like the big thing here, so I might try that, but the line was like crazy. Yeah, the lines for all the little stands are like miles deep, you know? Like you're waiting to get into a house, but you're grabbing a drink or food. It's still full from those tots though. Tots were so good. Yeah, I can't believe how full I was from that. We haven't eaten since then. We ate that like this morning.
have been Look at all this floor all space. So with much. With your robots in here. So many activities. It's making my head spin how many activities we can do. It is absolutely empty. About that time we're exhausted we got a long walk back to the room killed it at the parks today got some Panda Express <laughs> my feet are hurting <laughs> Steph's feet are hurting yeah I'm tapped out <laughs> I just want to thank you guys so much for tuning into the channel we appreciate everybody watching don't forget to like and subscribe till next time I'm Mike I'm Stephanie. <laughs> and we're the Traveling Cookies. Have a great night, guys.